What's crack a lack in AE Nation? Selly season on the AE report. Rap, rap, rap. Three lacrosse teams have clinched postseason bursts. Vermont and U Albany doing so in men's lacrosse after last weekend's results. Vermont can host the championship with a win over Stony Brook this Saturday. It will be the first time since 2014 that the championship is held somewhere else other than the campus of U Albany. First time since 2009 that the championship would be hosted in a state other than New York. Stony Brook women's lacrosse has won six straight games. That includes wins over top 20 opponents, Johns Hopkins and USC. They clinched their postseason berth with a win over U Albany last weekend. It was led by Allie Kennedy, a career high. Seven goals to go along with three assists and 11 draw controls in the win. New Hampshire and U Albany just a game back from the Seawolves for the Wildcats. They have their highest win total since the 2010 season. And it was just last week they were playing BU in the snow in Durham. I don't know about anyone else, but that gives me some flashbacks to backyard football. Tara Belinsky had a good weekend in the pit as the U Albany grad student now ranks 21st in the nation in the shot put. UMass Lowell softball has won 12 straight games. And I say Courtney Coppersmith, you say no hitter. That's correct. Third no hitter of the season for the UMBC freshman. The only thing left to do now is just this gif. And for that reason, I'm out.